Hi, Jacob Jewell here with the tip of the week. We're going to be talking about maintenancing your trolling motor in the lower unit. Uh, most guys get out there on the water and you feel some resistance with your prop and a lot of times, nine times out of ten, there's line wrapped around your prop. Well, the best way to do this is every time you get off the water, just get your tool here and it comes with most of the, if you buy a new trolling motor prop or anything like that and it's also good to have an extra prop anytime you're on the water. Just it, That can really cut a day short quick. And uh, what you do is you want to get your tool. You want to get on the little pin here and you want to twist it to the left. Once you loosen it up, you can take that off and twist it off with your hand. After you get that, set that to the side and you're done with your tool for now. You want to slowly wiggle your prop loose. Sometimes it's best to put your thumb on the over the pin there. Alright, that was a little hard to get off because we do have line actually wrapped around our prop. Now what you want to do is set your prop to the side and you've got what you call a shear pin. This little pin right here is what actually keeps the prop from spinning out. It's kind of like your bearings on your trailer. And so what you want to do is always make sure that pin's not bent and make sure it's held good together. You want to set that to the side. Then you want to slowly unravel the line, making sure that you get all of it. And a lot of times this line, what it'll do is, if you don't check it on a regular basis, this line will get wrapped around down here and it will cut through the actual motor itself and allow it to get down in the lower unit. After you get all the line loose, just set that back. And you want to just maintain, make sure, I always spin it to make sure it's loose and you can actually still spin it and just check your all your connections. What you want to do is get your shear pin, put it back in, about halfway, then you get your prop. Your prop's got this section that the shear pin fits down into. You want to make sure that's always lined up. Once you hear the click, you know it's on. Then I slowly, I put this back on, get it hand tight. And then you can take your tool again. You want to make sure it tightens up, so not your prop to come off. And then, now you're ready to go fishing. And this tool actually, it comes with a little area on it. You can unhook that and it's got some extra pins in there. And these is great if you're on the water because that, that pin can really ruin your day if you don't have a spare. And I always keep this tool. That's one of the biggest tools we have on the boat. Alright, have a good week.